everyone, Dave Greco here again, and today I actually wanted to talk to everyone about a couple things. Uh, first off, in the background, we have our uh, Light Forge Drain Eye piece that we did on stream. Actually, it's probably been a month and a half ago. Uh, this piece was actually something that kicked off a lot of our WoW commissions that we started working on. And this piece was pretty important for me because this was the piece that I started working on right after BlizzCon where you're channeling all that uh, inspiration. You really want to get back down to work. And this was something that someone had sent me a, uh, I think a month or two prior to that. And so I was super excited to dig in. As we started the piece, you'd notice it didn't start exactly at the beginning of the sketch. Uh, usually the piece that we work on, it's something I got approval from the client beforehand. I was like, oh, this is what I'm thinking. This is where we're going to go. And they give me the thumbs up and then we go into rendering. So that's kind of where it started out. I apologize for a lot of these time lapses that were from stream. I hate having the alerts and all that stuff cover up some parts of it. Uh, halfway through the video actually shows where my cam cover is, where so it doesn't look like I'm warping through time. I actually get shifted to the right of the screen. And that seems to be a better place for it. I tend to work on paintings toward the left, so hopefully uh, later on in the video it, it doesn't cover as much. But a big part of this video also is me talking about really us wrapping up our first year of 2018 uh, between Twitch, uh, YouTube, Instagram. It's 2018 for me was pretty much the year where we got it all going, right? Uh, is when I really buckled down to focus on all these things. And so it was a huge year, and I think all of you for coming over and hanging out on the YouTube channel, coming over to Twitch, uh, watching me paint night after night. It's really been amazing. And so I really want to try to take it up a whole new level for 2019. So, I'll, you know, like most of the videos, I do apologize for not getting content as, out as much as I would like, but it really, really means a lot for you guys to uh, stick, out, stick around for all this stuff. It's really fantastic. I've been looking at lots of different kind of video formats that we could do for the channel, looking at a lot of stuff that Mikey Mega Mega does, who is a um, fellow YouTuber, and you know, I consider him a friend. He pops over to the uh, Twitch channel a lot, says hi, and hangs out with us, and it's really great. And he has some really cool content that he does, whether it's just um, showing reviews or kind of like portfolio stuff, or just kind of chatting with you guys while, uh, while painting. I think is, I, I would definitely like to add a little bit more of that to the channel, so. So basically like this, you can kind of see the same process as I've been doing for a lot of the pieces so far. It's having that black and white, and then I'm really kind of cleaning up a lot of line drawing over it, right? I'm trying to find out those shapes more and more as we go. So as you can see here, I really figure out more of the shoulder pieces, where the hands are, and then I'm kind of figuring out where I want some of the light to be. I know I kind of want some of that light around the bottom of her jaw and her face. I think that'd be pretty interesting. This was an interesting character too, because I never painted, you know, before these WoW commissions, actually I hadn't painted a lot of WoW characters. Oh, looks like we were looking at those and how awesome. This was the time all those came out and they were amazing, by the way. And it was great to tackle a Light Forge right now, uh, especially one being a Frost Mage with uh, what looks like very paladin looking armor. I thought it was a very, very cool look. So I was really excited to dig into that. But yeah, I, I'm just, I'm super pumped for what we've accomplished in the last year. We really started with uh, not knowing what it was going to do as far as even Twitch or YouTube. And to see where it is even grown to today, I'm so happy and I'm really just appreciative of all you guys. It's, it's really, really amazing. So I started to jot some things down on some things we want to start doing for the channel. More than just time lapses and small tutorials. I think for me, I may start kind of running out of things that, you know, quick tips on how to do hair and stuff like that. So I'm compiling a list of cool ideas and a theme of things that we can create videos for to really kind of grow the channel even further. And I think you guys would be able to take a lot from that as well. We also started doing a lot of portfolio reviews on Twitch. And I think at one point I may try to record them and actually just upload the entire portfolio review session to the channel even though it'll be kind of a recording of our, of our uh, Twitch chat. But I think seeing peop other people's portfolios being reviewed and critiqued, even if it's not your own, you can take so much of certain elements that you see and bring that into your own work. Because there's a lot of things that kind of get repeated over and over. And so I think it's valuable just to even see. So I'd love to bring some of that over to the YouTube channel as well, even though that might just be a straight recording. 
But all right, I'll let the rest of the time lapse play out like usual. Uh, a lot of the same music uh, is in this video as the uh, previous one. Uh, it was good. We're through the holidays. We're starting the year. So my schedule is opening back up so we can really tackle some really, really awesome work. Guys, thank you so much as always. And I will see you in the next video.